Monopolies and economic welfare loss. The profit maximizing monopolist will operate at output Q and price P. So why is this a problem? Well, if the industry is perfectly competitive, equilibrium would be at point K, with welfare at maximum. Welfare is the sum of the industry's consumer and producer surplus. But, if monopolized, demand becomes the average revenue curve and supply becomes the marginal cost curve. Here, consumer surplus shrinks while producer surplus grows. There is a loss of consumer surplus and a net gain in producer surplus, but it is important to note that there is an overall or net welfare loss of area AKL. So what can be done? Options range from opening up the market to competition, price capping, imposing regulations, deregulating if the monopoly is state controlled, and even nationalisation where the state takes over ownership and control. In the UK, energy companies have been price capped, and although not pure monopolies, they have a large degree of monopoly power. For a regulator, deciding the level of the cap is difficult and setting it too high can force the firm into making losses. In more general terms, regulators can suffer from what is called regulatory capture, where those entrusted to regulate may, perhaps unwittingly, take the side of those it should be regulating.